Something worrying you, Andre? Why should I be worried? Your wife's having a baby. It's wonderful. <laughs> Uh, I want you to always, always be my best friend. Never change, Dustin Henderson. <laughs> I've finally done something to please my mother. I've given her a baby. An heir! <laughs> How are you? Good? Because you're about to not be good. <laughs> yeah, I'm going to break your fucking heart, actually. She died. And the baby died too. I'm being punished. I'm a bad person. A mother punishes her, her husband, and then her son punishes his mother for what he thinks that she did to his, his father. And, and then the curse goes down the family, and misery gets passed on from generation to generation. I have been speaking to the doctors. <laughs> My son. I don't want to get up. I understand that. You don't understand. I met someone who actually loved me, and now she's... She's dead. You must eat. No. Oh, come on, get a grip. Now, I understand how you feel. Do you? Your wife is dead, and your son is dead. It, it's time to move on. Why are you the way that you are? Where are we going? No, 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 this is her room. Why have you brought me here? I want to show you something. Do not touch that. That is, that is her private drawer. Get out. Get out! Letters from your best friend, with whom she was having an affair. How dare you say such vile things to me? You're lying. You're lying. Read. Can, can you read? This is really cool. Oh, you can, can I read? Yeah, can you? Can you host? What a boot. The Princess Sophia of Württemberg. Pretty wake up! I love my day! Hey, look. Wake up, Chrissy! I love my day! I am besotted with this infant. <laughs> oh, hello. When do we get him back, Mother? In five years, when he's reached the age of reason. That was a joke. <laughs> I do not want to go on a state visit to the Austrian court. This, this, this is a little scheme of Potemkin's, isn't it? To do with his adventures down south while I'm not going. God, this man has taken control of the whole court. You will go and you will leave my grandson with me. I will not go! I will not! Uh, don't worry, darling. I'll take good care of him. I have come to offer my four battalions, Mother, for the war. I want to do something. Staying at home with your wife is the best thing you can do. Now put your toy soldiers back in their box. Shoulder up! About face! This is going to be our little secret, all right? My mother is poisoning the boy against me. I am not going to be made of no account. I am not going to sit in the corner while my mother struts around the stage. Where is he? You were going to bring him home. Darling, it's all right. It doesn't... She tried to get me on her side, to write something, something that would allow Sasha to take the throne instead of you. But... And? I'm loyal to you. I said I'd do nothing of the kind. Wives betray their husbands. There is no loyalty. There isn't any. <laughs> I am loyal to you. Paul, I am loyal to you. And I hope you remain loyal to me. I just thought you'd bring him home. Where are our private papers? Where are they? Get out. She's still alive. Get out! Out! Is this what you made you suffer? Is it? She is dead. Your Majesty.
no woman ever again rules Russia. My mother took the crown from my father. It was never hers by right, and now it is mine. I want to take a shower with him. No, I mean, I mean, I, 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 mean, I wanted to be, I wanted to have him as a pet. He is buried in you. Got a shower or even heard it make out with him. I mean, love is what's left of us after everything else has gone. Poets would like us to believe that. But what do they know?